Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to Wind Waker HD. So last time we arrived at Greatfish Isle in search of our third pearl as well as Jabun, which I can only assume is going to be like a giant fish thing. He wasn't there, turned out he bailed because some shit went down, there's like a curse on the island. So then we found out some pirates are up to no good on Windfall Island. Again, I don't know what the hell they're doing. So we came here. We found out how to get on their boats, and we got some bombs. And long story short, that means we should now be able to get into where the hell Japan has moved to, which is apparently back on Outset Island, where we started the game. Hopefully that makes sense. Frankly, I don't even know what the hell is going on. Anyway, you know the drill by now. We're gonna travel there. I don't expect much will happen along the way, because we've already traveled pretty much this exact path before. We're just going in reverse. But, you know, we'll see. I don't know what the hell this is, and again, we're pretty much on the same path, so... Is this new? How the bloody hell could I have missed this? And yeah, apparently, you may remember, now that we have bombs, we can actually use them as a cannon when we're on our boats. So I'm guessing we can... Ne oh, holy shit, that nearly hit me. I'm guessing now we can probably blow up these dudes and maybe find out what the hell is going on here. That also nearly hit me. We kinda need to get out of here, and also we need to be closer so I can actually hit this dude, because... We keep missing. It's a huge waste of bombs. Okay, we hit him. It looked like we did damage. Oh, shit! Okay, get the hell out of here. We're down to one hearts. That's no good. We do have the Alexia, like the soup. And again, I'm assuming since we're going back to Outset Island, we can probably just chug our soup and get some more from our grandmother. Of course, I don't want to have to do that. But maybe we will. And yeah, I'm just ignoring all of the uh, the sunken booty for now, because it seems to just be entirely rupees, unless you're using, like, a treasure chart or something. So, since we don't need the cash right now, it just seems like a huge waste. Okay, so I found... God damn it, more freaking sharks. Get out of here. I just murdered, like, four other bastards. Anyway, I found another one of these weird crow nest sunken ship watchtower things. I, I don't know what the hell they are. I remember we passed a couple of them before I even knew what they were and that you could climb them. So this may have been one that we saw, but either way, I don't think we've actually climbed up here, so... Really? Another shark? What the hell? I'm gonna go check it out, and yeah, hopefully there's some kind of amazing booty up here. I'm surprised how few heart pieces we found so far, though. Oh, sweet freaking Jesus. There's like six dudes! What the hell? It's like a Bacoblin Lemma party! Oh my, okay, no, 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 stop, Jesus! <laughs> well, damn. That sucked, I just lost a heart and a half. We can't afford to keep doing that. And by the way, in case you're wondering why I'm not checking out the, uh, God, this light is on. In case you're wondering why I'm not checking out the bottles, it's because they tend to have spoilers, so I don't want to read them. Okay, well, we killed, like, two dudes, I think. And apparently, the leaf does basically nothing. Okay, well, that gets rid of a couple more. Hopefully, we should be able to handle it now. God, God, that was insane. I was really not expecting them to all jump on me like that. Yes. You get off the side yourself. Oh, hello, buddy. Jump attack. Yeah. Suck on that. Hey. And we got a chest. Which has... Really? A golden feather? That's crap. I can farm them off the pee hats. That sucks. Worst booty of all time. Okay, get back in the boat before the shark beats me up. And apparently something's shooting at me. Oh, it's the, uh, the tower. There's one of these orb thingies down here. Again, there still seems to be some kind of great debate about whether or not they do drop different things depending on when you smash them. I don't know. Either way, we just can't smash it. Who, who freaking cares? Okay, and we got, uh, we got a joint pendant. Good. I think we're close to 20 now, like maybe 16, 70. I am nearly dead. Jesus Christ. Okay, I'm gonna have to chug the soup again. When we go back to outset, we can get more, I hope, unless grandmother's dead or something. You never know. It's a possibility, I guess. So yeah, hopefully, and I think that's it in the distance, so hopefully, that shouldn't really matter. And again, I interrupted myself, can't remember what the hell I was saying. Hopefully, you got the points. But maybe not. Hey, we've arrived. That was kind of quick, at the end anyway. The sailing, not so much. Have you noticed, Link? Morning has not broken since we arrived at Greyfish Isle, the land that was so ravaged by monsters. It is as if the ti time itself is frozen. God, that's a tongue twister. Perhaps this is the curse that Velu spoke of. Whatever the reason, if this night does not end, then we need not worry about the pirates overtaking us. In fact, it might not be a bad idea for you to visit your hometown or family again after such a long time away. We can speak with Japan after you do. That's candy, because again, we need more soup. Not that we have much of a family. I mean, we got a grandmother and a sister and our sister. 
she kind of got kidnapped and uh, we're still trying to save her because we are literally the worst hero of all time. See, I just bumped into a tree. Who does that? The Three Stooges do that shit. And yes, by the way, I noticed the trifle was on the door. She also had it on her blanket when, you know, we gave her the fairy. I meant to point out, but I forgot. My dear sweet Link, aren't you? Oh, okay, so she's talking about the soup. Yes, Grandmother, fill me with your soup. Okay, so, we got the soup back. That's a very good thing. That means all the shitty damage I took doesn't really matter. Now, do you have anything else to say? You and the sister, oh, okay, that's what you said last time. Do you have anything else? Link! Oh, she's just talking about damn soup. The woman's possessed. Possessed, I tell you. She's become a monster. She I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. <laughs> okay, well, anyway, we uh, we spoke to what little family we have, and we spoke about soup. And they're just, uh, and they're just normal. Oh, hello, buddy. What the hell are you doing there? You, uh, you weren't there before. Apparently, I was told that you can actually grappling hook them up from the, yeah. When they go into the blob state down the ground where you can't hit them, you can grappling hook them and pull them back up again. It's actually extremely handy because it saves time and makes them less annoying to fight because they are really annoying to fight. Aha! Uh -huh. We got magic we don't need. Fantastic. Alright, see Beetle's boat over there. Frankly, I ain't got time for that shit. Okay, so we need to go around the back. What? Oh, are you ready? If that is the case, then we must search for the cave around the back side of Outset, where Jabin is said to hide. That's what I was just about to say. We need to go around the back of Outset Island and try and find this cave entrance. I was about to say I don't remember seeing it, but then again, we didn't actually ever go around the back of the island, so I guess that makes sense. Okay, so I guess it's probably going to be pretty much directly at the back. What the bloody hell is that? Ah, oh, that looks like a door to me. So I'm guessing that's it. Why is there a giant swirly whirlpool of death outside of it? That that just that don't seem like a good idea that we go in that. But I'm kind of tempted just to see what happens. I think I'm stuck. Well, shit. Didn't actually mean to throw my boomerang there. I'm kind of mashing buttons right now. <laughs> How do I get out of here? I. Does the cell help? Cell doesn't seem to do anything. I could be wrong, but I don't think we're even really going towards the center. We're just kind of stuck in a perpetual loop. Oh, wait a minute, I'm a goddamn moron. We have the cannon. Maybe this is how we get in the door. Because using a bomb from here, probably kind of impossible otherwise. Oh, I missed. That's an excellent start. The frame rate has gone to shit. What the hell? <laughs> like, no. Explosions. It's too much for the game to handle. I mean, admittedly, you know, it's raining and we're sailing around in an open world and there's a swirl pool of death, but still, the frame rate really should be holding up and it's just nuts. Like, it's going really bad. Please, Link, just blow up the door so we can fix the frame rate. <laughs> I don't know how noticeable it would be, noticeable it would be on YouTube. It's not normally that much. I think it's the way YouTube encodes videos, like, I don't know, it's hard to explain, but... It's much more noticeable before it goes up as a video. Put it that way. Oh, I guess we, uh, I guess we did it. Well, thank God for that. Holy shit, the water effects look awesome. Like on the, on the cave. I knew it, he looks like Jabu Jabu. What up, buddy? Well met indeed, Jabin. I am pleased to see that you are safe. Uh, thanks, G. Yes, it seems Ganon has returned. There could be no other explanation. I, I, I... <laughs> Unfortunately, that is not so. The one I have brought with me has no connection to the legendary one. Ah, and yet I sense great promise and the courage that this one possesses. I do. It is the only way. I have no idea what he's saying. Oh! That was easy. We don't have to do a dungeon for it, really? I don't trust you. You got Nehru's Pearl. The water spirit Jabon was kind enough to give you this jewel, a treasure of one of the goddesses. Probably Nehru.
He's gonna eat me, isn't he? So, that foul rain and endless night were indeed elements of a curse brought upon us by Ganon. He must intend to cast this land into pure darkness for all time. I believe I have. I'm trying to guess what the giant fish man's saying. I, I have no idea. Like none. Ganon's curse has been broken by the power of the pearl the javelin gave us. The morning should come soon. It is well that we have gathered all of the pearls. Yeah, you don't say. Are you ready, Link? I've marked the place where you must put, set the pearls on your sea charts. I knew it! Once you have placed each pearl in its proper location, the proving grounds for your courage will become apparent. Clearly, the search for Jabin has shown us that Ganon has begun to make efforts to block our path forward. It is certain that the perils ahead will be greater than any you have faced thus far. You should finish any business you have here on Outset Island for now, so that you shall not have to any regrets later on. I... oh, that's right! I knew there was something else we want to do here. First of all, let's grab this tingle bottle that I'm never actually going to look at. What can I say? It really bothers my OCD leaving the damn things around. God, it's annoying. Anyway, god damn, I may have to change the direction of the wind, because, uh... This is kind of freaking ridiculous. How we go? Got, no, go in, go in that direction. Anyway! You may remember there was that giant obus boulder on top of the mountain peak where we went up to save Tetra. It said something about a fairy fountain or whatever, so now we have bombs, I'm assuming we can just go in there. It may be one of those rocks that we have to lift as opposed to blow up, but it looks like it's one you can blow up to me. And I think we did blow up some that were that big with uh, bomb flowers anyway, so... Yeah, I'm assuming we can now go up there and maybe get some kind of reward. It may just be a fairy fountain for healing, and if it is, that's kind of shitty, but, you know... I guess we'll see. Why is there a fish here? I... Don't know? Do we already have this guy? I feel like I haven't seen a fish for a second time, so... Maybe it's a new one. And surely this will be the one for Outset Island. Though maybe we're like just outside of it, but we're like right there. Oh, I guess we are. I think... Is that... Is that Outset? I have no bloody idea what's going on right now. Talk to me, fish buddy. I've heard that beneath the big head boulder on top of the hill here on Outsets is where the greatest treasure of all, the Golden Triumph Forks, are buried. But actually, Fry, I must have misheard or something. Because this one guy told me that what was actually buried beneath that weird rock was some shard of something called a Triforce. Whoever heard of that? That's crazy. There's a big difference between Triumph Forks and Triforce. I mean, I think someone intentionally buried something misleading there. I see. So, it sounds like there's going to be a piece of the Triforce just chilling out underneath uh, a Skull Rock around here. I don't remember a Skull Rock, but sure? I mean, I guess he didn't say Skull, he said Big Head, but... It probably looks like the other Big Head that we found. That is a good point, maybe the heads indicate Triforce pieces. Maybe the island we found with one of the heads, maybe that's another place. I have no idea, again, I'm purely guessing here. Seems a bit weird that that would be how it works, though maybe there are dungeons. Don't really now. Anyway, get, looks like the bridge is out. I guess I'm gonna go check anyway, but... In fact, yeah, the bridge did fall, because... I remember we were like, no, sister... Well, not that Link actually speaks. Not that we hear, anyway. We were like, no, Arrol, and we almost fell off, and uh, Tetra caught our arm. So yeah, the bridge, uh... Bridge is broken. We may be able to cross the gap, though, on our leaf, so... Yeah, let's go give it a try. Whoa! <laughs> hey, what the hell are you? I... Yeah, you weren't here before. I I don't even know what they are. They look like little devil things. Apparently they die in like one shot, so I guess they're not that bad. They seem real quick, though. They genuinely look like little tiny devils. Get that, that freaking get out of here! Don't you? Hey, you want some too? Boomerang of justice. What? Did he just tank my boomerang in the face and run off? It didn't even stun him. What the hell? Okay. Note to self, don't boomerang those things. Right, well, anyway, yeah, the bridge, uh... Bridge is definitely out. And it goes in a straight line, so... We're gonna naturally sink when we use the feather, so... The feather. The leaf, so I don't know how the hell we're gonna cross that. Ho ho. So close. If only I could fly to the top of that hill, if only. Beneath that rock head, the triumph. Oh. I neither spoke aloud without thinking. It is a secret. Yes. Quite a secret. The triumph, eh? And the fish mentioned the head. 
So that's got to be it over there. So he said something we got flying. Again, we have the leaf. And that's definitely down from us, but that is a bloody long way. I mean, like, maybe if the wind's kind of perfect, we might be able to go across there. I guess we'll try? I'm trying to think, is there anything else around here, like up here? I could have sworn I remember something being up here in the demo. Though I may just be confusing that. I I guess I am? I, I really don't know. Maybe we want to go from this rock? Eh, uh, maybe not, because it's further away. It's kind of debatable. I, screw it, I guess we'll try? And yeah, let's try to stand right about here, and let's get the wind in the right direction, because again, wind makes a humongous difference. Okay, hopefully that's good enough. Bonsai! It's looking good, we're going pretty quick. Oh, we're sinking. I... I don't know. I feel like if we're gonna make it, we're only just gonna make it, which... If there is a piece of Triforce here, I guess it would naturally be a difficult thing to make. We're gonna make it! I can't freaking make it! Yes! Like a champion. Hey, we even got some magic power back. Okay, so it's just occurred to me we can't actually lift this bloody thing, so it's gonna be pointless. Yeah. And I'm very certain the bombs aren't gonna work, so I'm not even gonna try it, but you know what? What do you wanna say? You just gonna say the same damn thing you said last time? Yes, okay. Well, get up to now. So yeah, we need some kind of power bracelet, and then... We potentially know where two pieces of the Triforce are. Again, that one seems pretty damn certain. Unless it really is something called, like, Triumph Forks. But, uh... Seems unlikely to me. And I guess this is how you get this rupee over here. Well, there you go. Finally figured it out. Right, well, anyway. Let me chug our soup, get some more, and then we'll carry on. Okay, I don't know what the hell I'm looking at here, but... Is it just my imagination, or does that seem way bigger than the other cyclones we've seen so far? That thing looks goddamn terrifying. And there's like a whole bunch of booty here? I'll be honest with you, I don't really want to fish up like five of them. Especially since they're probably all going to be money. I guess we'll, uh... We'll try one of them. But first of all, let's try getting on Beetle's boats, because... And again, this is probably my imagination, but this boat looks smaller to me. And someone mentioned something about some kind of unique... Beetle boat, I guess it probably looks different, I don't know. But apparently he sells some good shit on there, like I think maybe a bottle and... Heart pieces? He's got a bottle. This is a good, this is a good sign. Pirates will be bombs for the cheap. As a chance, bye bye bye. By the way, Mr. Customer, are you acquainted with that adorable little pirate girl? You have a special look on your face, Mr. Customer. You can't hide it from me. Yuck, 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 yuck. Yuck, 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 yuck. I, I'm Popeye and such. Oh, it's a potion. And we don't have an empty- God, just sell me the bottle, you dick! Son of a bitch! Okay, so maybe this isn't the one. But yeah, he definitely seems to be selling some different stuff. I guess we'll fill up on bombs, because again, we may as well we have full cash. And this way, if we do go, you know, pull up a, a 50 rupee from the seafloor, that way at least it won't go to waste, so it seems like a good idea to me. But yeah, we definitely went to that island. That's the one with the hole surrounded by the fire, and there was that little leafy dude there that was like, I need you to get water from the great Deku tree. Deku, sorry. Apparently it's pronounced Deku. Which seems weird to me, but, you know, who the hell am I to question it? Now, since this is in, like, a, a pentagon shape, I'm guessing the middle... No? I thought it was, like, supposed to be represented that something was hidden in the middle, but... I guess not. Let me get this one. No. Why do I find it so blo- God, that thing is really close. Why do I fi find it so bloody hard to get these things? God, it's annoying. Okay, take your time. We're gonna, we're gonna get- This is why I cut this out. This is how this shit goes every single time. I struggle for like five minutes to pull the bloody thing up. Okay, I think it was about here. Yes, okay. Please don't be rupees. You know it's going to be, though. I'm wondering if, like, the, the points, that, that's gonna be the goal, I don't know, it's probably all rupees. Yeah, okay, son of a bitch. Well, I guess, you know, we'll try and remember to come back to that when we need cash. And yeah, the cyclone, I just gotta try and avoid that, because, again, that looks real freaking terrifying. Okay, I think we're pretty close to where we have to put one of the pearls, but not quite there yet, so I don't think this is it. I don't know what the hell it is. I see a post box. Oh, it's like a, a board down pass. Oh, by the way, apparently, yeah, that's what you do with the leaf piles. 
Makes perfect freaking sense. You know, we got a thing that blows air. It's a pile of leaves. Why the hell that didn't occur to me, I have no idea. Oh, hello, buddy. Are they the rare kind that someone was talking about? I want your juice. Yoink. Yes. Got some blue chew jelly. Yummy! Deep within blue choo choos is a gelatinous essence that is said to be a magical cure all. Unfortunately, it can't be used in this current form. Okay. Well, now you can uh, you can die. I'm guessing he's gonna shock us if we hit him. Can I boomerang you? Yes, I can. Is he dead? He's dead. We got one rupee. Oh, you didn't drop that. We got ten. That's even better. Not that we need them. So, we have bombs, and we blew up some of these with bombs in the second dungeon that we were in, so I would imagine this should work. I don't know what the hell this is. It looks like a shell. I don't know. I am very, very intrigued by this. And yes, I'm just dropping into a hole of doom, potentially. Holy shit, this place looks awesome. I'm guessing from the music, you know, probably going to be a fairy found here. Oh, I see one there. Hello. Okay, suddenly you look real evil. Young Waker of the Winds, allow me to aid you in your quest. Was that a Black Lotus? How damn pretty is this game? Hey, you can now carry more bombs, and we can carry 60. The fairies in this fountain shall ease your weariness when you grow fatigued from your battles. Come here to be refreshed. And away she slinks. Oh, she turned into like a million little fairies. Well, I think the red potion fully restores your HP. I think the fairies don't. But we don't have much max HP now, so I think a fairy is a safer bet, even if it doesn't quite restore as much. Just because this way it allows me to kind of be a dick and, you know, get beaten the shit out of, and I don't have to worry about chugging the potion to keep myself alive. You know, the fairy is a good insurance, so we don't get another game over, because that really sucked us. God damn, this place looks amazing. I I felt like I just had some kind of a spiritual experience. That was kind of awesome. I hope those fairies come back. I mean, I would imagine they do. But uh, I kind of numbed them all up, and now I'm like, well, shit. What, what if they don't come back? We're doomed. I did not mean to put that. Oh, God. Still fumbling with the controls. God damn it, brain slash fingers. Where's my bolts? Dude, where's my bolts? Oh, it's over there. What are you doing over there? I guess it defaults to different locations, because, you know, it was originally a GameCube game, and uh, it doesn't really remember all that much. You know, I really thought something would be hiding in that tree, but apparently not. Okay, well, continuing on. Okay, I do believe that over there. Oh, hello, buddy. How's it going? I have a boomerang with your name on it. Dang! That was a little too close for comfort, good guy. And yeah, there's a whole bunch of these weird... Clowny face pee hat ginormous things of death around here. So, uh, oh shit, okay. Luckily, he backed off then, otherwise, probably would have taken a full heart of damage. These things are terrifying, man, even though we're two showing them. They're still terrifying. They fly at you, swinging their mouth around, and then they land in the water, and then they become like weird shark things. Look at that shit. It's like some Jesus! It's like something from a nightmare. Apparently, they don't do a full heart. Oh, he did that to him. You absolute son of a bitch. Get out of here. Well, that sucks. I don't want you stinking rupee. There's another one over there. I'm watching you, buddy. I'm watching you. I don't trust him. He's quite far away, though, but they do home in. Okay, well, anyway, let's place our goddamn second pull. This one looks like, uh... Lanero? Is that the one we just got? That was very creepy and very cool again. Yes, no, Nehru. Oh, I'm thinking of Lanehru, which is that, uh... Was that one of the four spirits of light from Twilight Princess? Which is, I guess, probably where they got the name from, you know, Nehru, Lanehru. I think they're all kind of very slight variants on the goddess and god's names and whatever else. I think they're all goddesses, maybe? Ah, oh, it's kind of hard to say. Anyway, let's carry on. Okay, sometime later, I do believe that's it over there. You can see it's like a little tiny thing in the distance. And yeah, this one is surrounded by a shit ton of the cyclones, though luckily, not the ginormous one that we saw earlier. I just heard an explosion. 
Well, shit. I don't really want to find out what the hell that was. Is that a friendly boat? Yeah, it looks like it's, uh, it's holding up booty. Yeah, it's the weird naked man. Ahoy, naked man! How's it going? God damn it, I get out of the boat every time! Son of a bitch, brain. Get yeah, used to the controls already. Yeah, bub. You're collecting treasure, bub. To see what we can find. Okay. You just gotta tell me how to get treasure. So you can hold out treasure, blah, 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 grappling hook. So, pretty sure this is what he told us before. Okay, well, I guess he's got nothing new to say. Then get out of my sights. I'm a man on a mission, smashing the goddamn competition. Kinda wanna pick up that bottle. Again, it really bothers my OCD leaving the damn things around. Okay, well... Yeah, this should be our final one. I am very excited to see what the hell is gonna happen here. Wondering traveler who's... Okay, yeah, same thing. You place for Rur -Rur -Rur's Pearl. Ah, shit. The control is vibrating like hell right now. <laughs> the way Link, like, dived, like, it's a bomb! I don't think it's a bomb. Never mind. <laughs> What the hell? It turned to a green girl, though, you know, that's that's a plus. I think I'm seeing where this is going. Yeah, it's gonna make the Triforce. Makes perfect sense in the game. You may remember when we went to Tetra's room, there was a picture on the wall that was like a map of the ocean that had a Triforce marked out like this. And I speculated at the time that was probably the way the, uh, the pose was set up. I'm very proud of myself. I would just like to point that out. What the hell is that? I can't tell if it's like a tower or a giant monster. Oh, I think it's a tower. Well, damn. I guess that's probably going to be our next dungeon. I'm surprised we didn't have to do one for Nehru's Pearl. It's tell which the pearls of the gods have seek caused to appear as a place that the gods of the ancient world prepared so that they might test the courage of men. I'm the one who is able to overcome the trials that await here will it be acknowledged by the gods to be a true hero. Only then will the hero be permitted to wield the power to destroy the great evil. Probably the Master Sword. Link. That which you must obtain now lies before you. You must believe in your own courage, which has led you to triumph over the many hardships you have faced. And you must triumph once again. You must rise above the trail of the gods. Don't worry, buddy. It's what I do. Alrighty! I'm gonna end it here next time. I'm losing my voice. Next time we go in there, and yeah, I'm very excited. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, it was appreciated. I like it. I'll see you next time for more Wind Waker HD.